I have arrived is what the, the game proclaimed when, when I started playing today. If you've been following along as we've been playing this here Vidya game on the channel, then today is to let you know that um, this is the new daily game. Yeah, how about that? I'm going to go ahead and start off with a sleep because that's how I roll. And if you haven't been following along, ooh, in your dream you sit beside a fire in a great hall, surrounded by the chatter of familiar voices. Their faces blur like smoke and their names slip from your mind, but the warmth of the something took too long because I was clicking to look away on my GoXLR for a moment and I missed the last words, but I bet they were amazing. Dang it, every time that comes up, I'm not ready for it because I'm looking away and then I realize that, you know, hey, the game's talking to me and I should, hey, pay attention, and I don't. Today on KIC Plays Falheim, can he get out the door? No. The answer to that is probably a resounding no. Let's go this way. I don't really know what we're doing today. Um, I went and collected a bunch of wood. You can see that. I don't know why. I just did. Kind of meant to look into one of the mods that is available. Because there are many a mod already available for this game. Even though I don't think there's necessarily a proper API for the game. That doesn't stop people from being awesome. But there are... Hi, how you doing? Uh, I was actually thinking I might... I don't really want a boar head, but whatever, we'll take it. I was thinking uh, I got these, these seeds here. And I was kind of wondering, like, how do I use them on the boars? That was that was one of my first wandering of the day. The next one was, is there a kicking skill? Or does that just fall under unarmed? Yeah, buddy. How you like them apples? That's right. I come over and I kick. And I just kick and kick and kick. I, I'm actually kind of wondering a bunch of things today, and I'm doing my best to play this game blind, which is probably obvious, and I know blind doesn't quite have the same meaning these days, and I don't mean it in any sort of pejorative microaggression, etc. sense. I just mean I am playing the game without the benefit or the ability or the know-how or the whatever that is widely available to me already. Nope. Like an idiot, I'm just trying to suffer my way through everything in the vain hope that I will figure out what it is I'm doing in this game. Okay. As best I can tell, that doesn't do anything. That doesn't seem to do anything either. So let's try the knife. Everyone knows you cut faster with the knife. And this thing I just plain can't swing. So building, crafting. Okay, nothing, nothing, nothing. Building. That's all building type stuff. And furniture. Uh, I don't see any furniture there that's going to do any good. I can make a wood stack. That actually would be kind of cool. What might have in a wood stack? Or a raft for that matter. What do you need for a wood stack? It just so happens we have 50 wood that we could turn into a wood stack. Let's go ahead and grab the club. I guess we'll use the shield today. Somewhere in this general vicinity was a building. I don't remember where. So I'm going to wander a little bit today. Ooh, blueberry. Anytime I can find some additional types of food, I think that's kind of a cool thing. Since it definitely seems like not all food is created equally in this game... It behooves one to collect various types of food should they desire to try to maximize, maximize, yes, maximize the output of their, well, uh, food type stuff things. Where in the crap was that building? Is that it? I don't think that was it. Maybe it was a little further north and then some more west. Have we been in this one? I think we've been in this one. Pretty sure we have. But we'll check just to, to be sure again. Um. Okay. Maybe we have not been in this one? Excuse me as I silly walk around it. 
Okay. Um. All right. Open sesame. Clickety clickety, lots of clicking. Yeah, no, we haven't been in this one yet. So some flint head arrows and some flint. Okay. I can work with that. Uh, by the way, here. You can have that. That's yours. That seems like a fair trade. I see a building over there. Maybe that's the one I'm thinking of. I'm not sure. Let us run! Run through the tenth world! Or whatever this is. And grab some more mushrooms, too, because we're going to need to eat a mushroom here shortly. Switch back to the club for the moment. I guess probably need to sit down and figure out if I can improve upon our equipment a little more. I wouldn't mind getting... Hello? Oh, you have... Oh, no. That, that wasn't what I thought that was. Ow, and stuff. Don't hit me. I'm friendly. Don't hit me. Oh, this is annoying. This is quite the hill to climb. Whew. Good luck. Oh, what? You made that look like not even anything. That's rude. Aha! Take that! You have been blocked. Oh, hey. Don't throw crap at me. That's rude. And explode into a bunch of stuff that I probably don't want. Excellent. This is what I'm looking for, is more of this crap. Um, coins. Again, I don't know what to do with coins. And again, I don't know what to do with amber. But we shall take all of that stuff. So this is not what I have found before. Anyway, this theoretically is the Black Forest. Because there are those guys running around. Gray dwarfies. Gray dwarfies. Gray, gray dwarves? I don't know. Cat. Do you at all care about what's going on with Grey Dwarves? I don't know that she does. Ooh, what are you? You are all... Ooh, Thistle. Okay. That sounds like that could be useful. And Grounded, you would use Thistles to make... Um, whatever you would make with them. Arrows, I think. <laughs> thistles. What is a Thistle? Oh, I guess I, I can't find out any more information that way. Okay. Beautiful, but prickly. Hmm. It's like me. Beautiful, but prickly. Especially if I haven't shaved in a couple of days. Oof. What are you? Carrot seeds. Interesting. We're finding all sorts of crap over here. I apparently should have played with one of the inventory mods, especially the one that gives you Equipment slots. Copper deposit. Is this what we found earlier? What we found earlier was a copper deposit, right? It was not a... Tin deposit. Metal, uh, iron deposit. Um, I don't know. The game said something about tin being available in Black Forest, so that's the only reason I know, or I presume anyway, that one can find tin out here. I can't see what I'm doing, guys. Okay, that one's about to get smashed. And we'll just collect whatever you dropped. Hi. Alan stuff. Oh, you multiplied. That's not okay at all. That's more resin. Okay. Gray Dwarf Trophy. Oh, look at that. We got the Mossy Severed Head of a gray dwarf. Well, isn't that exciting? Well, crap, I kind of think I need to go run back to the bed and drop off some of this stuff and also create yet another storage chest because we don't have enough of them already. Oh, man, I kind of think I might have to call an audible here. Uh, we don't have room for dandelions. Sorry, you can hold on to that. I don't want that. Kind of think I might need to call an audible and shift into extreme building mode. Do a home makeover or something here. Um, where am I going? North. I can follow directions, I promise. I can't really follow directions. I don't think we have any room for those kind of berries, right? 15 health, 20 stamina... Basically same as mushrooms. Okay. 
okay with that. Now we'll go ahead and eat one of everything again, since those were all winding down. And uh, somewhere over here should be a little home type thing. I see you on the horizon. Horizon. Okay. What I would like to maybe do is see if I can level a bunch of ground here. Can't you see I'm busy doing hoeing type stuff? This is a long road to hoe, tell you what. Is this even level? I have no idea. That looks like a pretty decent size space though, right? Hey. Okay, now. Uh, can I hit this thing? Yeah, see, I still need a pickaxe or something. I know I do. I just knows it. I knows it. Uh, can I do this? Let's see. Let's do some crafting things. Building type stuff. Can I... I need a workbench to make floors. Okay. If I'm standing right here... <laughs> well, I guess that's too far away from my workbench. Oh. Oh, I see. Well, then, um... Oh, wow. I did a terrible job right there. I still don't understand how this leveling tool quite works. I mean, I have completely messed up... Uh, uh, there, my door and stuff. But, um... I don't know, whatever. Here, let's drop... Those guys off. We don't have any room for any of those things. Here, let's drop that off. I need a sort button. That would be really great. Okay, where are the... Those are the flint head arrows. So let's drop those guys. Drop the flints. Drop the ambers. And then let's just see what we can make now with the thistle. Assuming there's anything we can make with the thistle. Thistle. Eat blech. Easy for me to say, antler pickaxe. Oh, wait a minute. Antler pickaxe. This tool is hard enough to crack even the most stubborn rocks. And we did get antlers from... Uh, what's his Ikethorn, if I'm not mistaken. Look at that. Allow us to make the antler pickaxe. Antler pickaxe. I'm genuinely excited about that. Not even not not even joking, lion joking, whatever. Any of those things. I still want to check out the spear, so we're gonna to have to do that at some point. Bone fragments. We're gonna need more bone fragments. So my hunch is that we've got to go run around in the black forest a little more, where I recall before we had found such things as. Skeletons that dropped bone fragments. Um, since that seems to be our trophy box, let's put that there. Man, I gotta cook a crap ton of food, don't I? Oh, goodness. Uh, the food box is kind of full. Alright, well, let's go back outside. And let's see if we can level this stuff a little bit more. Oh, hey, buddy. I'll be with you momentarily. Um, I guess, uh, let's mm, switch that guy out for this guy. Number six. That's what I'm talking about. Listen to that sound. That is delightful. Is this going to do anything? Oh, yeah, and now we're, now we're talking. All right, what is up, my good Betty Hugan? Black Forest is rich in minerals. There you can find copper in the ground and tin lining the ocean shore. Now go forth and strike the earth. Okay, so I'm going to read that again. Copper in the ground. We found two copper deposits. Tin lining the ocean floor. That is the one that I need to try to remember. 
Um, apparently, I'm also just blasting the ground, which is not what I was trying to do. I wanted to get rid of this giant rock right here, which is big and stuff. It's kind of in the way of, of what I was hoping to build here. I mean, it's cool, don't get me wrong, but it's kind of messing with my motif. I suspect we might need both tin and copper for stuff. I'm gonna need a, a rest here for a second. Oof. And this one I'm probably gonna have to raise the ground if I had to guess. And then I might be able to level this guy out. Um, I guess it's maybe the area you click on. That's... I don't know. Whatever. I'm busy! It seems like it tries to match to whatever is on your... crosshair, but yet... <laughs> I don't know what's happening here. Okay. Uh, back to this. This. Got it. Okay. That's not really... doing a very good job of matching. Like, I just need to lower you, I think. Pathen, huh? Maybe that's what I need to do. I just need to path in everything. What what does that even do? I don't even know what I'm doing. I'm pathanizing. Is that like pasteurizing? I suspect it's not the same. Am I adding rocks everywhere I do that? I don't know. I'm not sure what I'm doing. I wanted to make some... Try to make some floors, because I thought... If I can get some floors in place, maybe that would... Oh, gosh. This is awful. I don't understand what I'm doing here. I just want this to be level so that I'm not hating everything in this building. But it doesn't seem to be getting better. It's like I'm not even doing anything useful. I, I really need uh, leveling ground for dummies. I mean, look at that. That looks terrible. Who did all this work anyway? Don't don't hire them to do your flooring, because they're awful. Yeah, I see. I think I just completely undid what I just did. That's great. All right, uh, I'm just gonna deal with this here. Make some wood floors and stuff. Um, can you make ramps? We can make stairs. I guess we could do that. We could do something like this. Oh. Uh, I guess we would have to... Crud. Can I lower ground? What happens now if I try to make stairs? Will that snap right there? Oh, that does. Brilliant. That's probably a thousand times better than everything I've been trying to do at this point. Now can I snap some stairs to right there? No. Because that would be useful. Okay, can I... Can I maybe raise the floor right here? No. Because now I can't get out. Excellent. Okay. That might have worked. Okay. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be okay with that. In fact, I'm going to be ecstatic with that, I think. Uh, eight. Okay. Floors and stuff. We need two wood for this so we can make a bunch of floors. And so we'll do one, two, three. Oh, this looks awful. They're not. Oh, goodness. You're not at all lined up. Why aren't you lined up? How do I remove that now? No, nope, not that one. That one. I can read. Mouse three! Oh, this is just a nightmare.
Whoever thought that the, uh... I don't know. Am I am I really just that bad and I don't know how to level don't know how to level the floors? I don't quite I can't imagine I'm that awful at it, but eh, then again, I am pretty good at being awful. Oh, it is really dark out by the way. Can I get a um No, I can't. Maybe I can. Okay, there we go. Except now Cannot have both of those things at the same time. So noted. Okay. Um. No? No. That, that just didn't work at all. Did that drop it now? Hi, how you doing? I can't see anything, it's too dark. Did I just, like walk around for the entire night. Have I managed to do that just yet? Oh, this is terrible. Why can't I lower ground? Explode. Let me put a floor down. Alright, I might just have to be okay with that. Alright, I want to sleep. I'm tired. And I'm cranky. And uh, I can't see what I'm doing anymore. Oh, you need uh, wood. Cooking station. Fuel! There we go. Surrounded by the clatter, chatter of familiar voice, the face blur like smoke, the name slip for your mind, the warmth of their memories lingers. Whew! Got it that time. Got it. Okay. Day 11. In which we gaze upon the wonder of this floor and um, my inability to make it level. Oh, and of course it's going to be raining all day, so I still can't see what I'm doing. Excellent. Does that maybe lower it for me? I was trying to figure, like, can you... Can you hold down the button? To make it do stuff that doesn't seem to do anything. All right, let me try and place the floor one more time. It does not look like that one's gonna fit there. I don't have one there because I cannot destroy it. All right, let's just go collect some some copper and call it good. I'm gonna leave the door open. If anyone wants to go inside, have at it. Oh man, look at this thing. This looks vicious. Bonk. Yeah, I like that. That's good stuff. Can I... Can I make beacons? I forget. Can I do that? I want to say maybe I can. Maybe I can't. And I guess I could make, like, uh, a standing torch. That might not be a bad idea. Just something that kind of stands out a little bit so I know where I'm going when I'm... Or at least I kind of, sort of, have a marker so I know where to find stuff. Well, I still have to go recover my body, apparently. I thought we already did that. Guess not. Alright, this copper deposit I thought was somewhere down here. Coming through, everyone. Coming through. Go ahead and eat one of those. Didn't really empty any inventory space, did I? That's fine. Where was that deposit? It was somewhere over here. There's the... building that has the boar's head in it. And I guess it could be back here a little more. It's not you, right? I thought it was maybe a little more south, but I guess this is really about as south as we've been. So this isn't right. I don't think it was this way. Grab the blueberries as we run by. 
Is this it? This looks like it right here. Okay. Can I... Can I put, like, a, a marker here or something? I guess not. Well, it's a little east and a bunch south. And a little west of that and then a little bit south. Okay. I guess my next question, too, is... How much copper can we get out of this deposit? Is it like something that you have to just hack away at and you get a bunch? Or is it going to be limited? I believe the answer to the question is limited. Hail, warrior. Uh, I'm busy. Be with you in a moment, Hugan. Ooh, was that, did that say iron ore? I don't think it did. Um, guys. Wow, these are the full-on gray dwarves. Um, now you guys don't like fire, right? Be with you in a moment. Or someone doesn't like fire. I was actually hoping to switch to my shield. Because that seemed like that might be more useful. Let me knife y'all a question. Why are there so many of you? This is really not an exciting fight. And everyone just kind of stands around like a weirdo. While I smash them with a club. Which, I mean, I guess works out for me. Although I need some, some stamina here, guys. Uh, five. That's what I was trying to switch to. I mean, I went as far as switching the item out of the tool belt, but not actually using it. No? I was trying to see if there's, like, any sort of timing mechanism going on here. Okay. Now, let's go talk to Hugin, because Hugin's been patiently awaiting, I think. Oh, did you fly away? You were, like, right over here. Well met. Uh, there you are. You're over there. My bad. I thought you were somewhere else. What's up, buddy? Raw ore needs to be refined in the smelter before you can work it at the forge. To build a smelter, you will need circling cores search for them in the dark places beneath the earth. Okay. Um, so, I assume that means caves, but can I just dig a hole into the earth and find them that way? Like, can I make my own cave? Does that work? What did I get here? So I got four copper. I did not get iron. Okay. I just wanted to make sure on that. I don't know how many of these things to get, because apparently they don't do any good just yet. So here, why don't we knock out one more spot, and then I guess uh, I'll call it good on the copper collection. Okay. And then I wanted to see what this was. That's just the sun and the, the rain and all that jazz. And then... Ocean. Where would the ocean be? This should theoretically be the shore. But it's not going to be the ocean. It's going to be the river. Guess we can pick up some flint while we're here. I did kind of want to wander around it just a little bit to see if there is anything else. Like a little tin deposit or something. This looks like the ocean to me, so no. This... This is the ocean. And it said you could find tin... in the ocean, so... Are we talking like those guys? What are we talking about here?
I love how the water is ebbing and flowing, rising and falling. That's really cool. We try bashing this guy and see if this is just a big stone or if it's maybe tin. Just stone. Okay. I mean, I kind of figured if it was something else it would say as much, but heck, I don't know. Got a log over here. More stones, I assume. Let's go run down the shoreline just a little bit. Maybe there will be something else over here that kind of stands out a little bit. You look like you're stone. I love this the water going up and down. This is so cool. I mean, look at the waves out there. Oh, that is so good. Go ahead and chomp on the last neck that we have. Which, even with context, sounds a little strange. I wonder if there's a fishing rod. I would be surprised if there's not. Okay, I'm going to swim around just a touch. Just so I can see if there's anything obvious here. Not seeing it, if so. A little concerned about stamina here. Can I just float? Not use any stamina? Because that would be spectacular, if so. I know, I'm going to drown. It's fine. I'm fine. I think I'm fine. Oof. I got a little hairy there. Okay, stone, flint. All right, I guess I have a little research to do or a lot of wandering or, or something. I'm not quite sure which to figure out. Maybe, hmm, maybe part of the issue too is maybe I'm not really in the black forest right here, although I'm not sure how I would be able to tell that necessarily. Like maybe if I go a little further to the south. That would still be considered the Black Forest. Maybe over here one would find tin and other such things. It's definitely logs. There's some necks. I wouldn't mind bashing you guys. I need, I need some more neck meat. I'm good with that. Seems like this guy. What is this? Nope, try that one. Nope, try that one again. Oh, um... Alright. Cool. Buddy. Bade. Bizze. I need to repair my... my antler axe here in a moment. I kind of want to bash one of these guys in the face with this and see what happens. Yeah, see, none of, none of these things are really leaping out at me as being like, Strike here, 410. And I assume I will need a pickaxe for it. I assume. Here, can I get some stamina back? Yeah, see, I was kind of wondering, like, maybe I need to go further in here so that I find a different part of the shoreline, maybe. Although, if I remember right, it said you can find tin on the bottom of the ocean. We're not really in the bottom of the ocean over here, per se. Ha! 
Tin deposit. Oh, that sounds bad. Ow. That's fine. Apparently one cannot cancel their attacks. So it's kind of like you gotta make sure you're good with what you're doing and commit to those attacks. Because there's no backing out on that. Okay, so there's some tin ore. And that got us four tin. Interesting. That was a lot of work to get the four copper. Comparatively, tin is much easier to come by. I hope I didn't just destroy all of that stuff. My bad. Let's go ahead and bash this one, too. Apparently, I'm supposed to be patient when I'm bashing things. It just doesn't seem like that goes together very well. Okay, I want to wander over here just a little more. I'm not going to hit these even if they are tin. I just want to kind of get a feel for where I will find this stuff. It looks like it is pretty much on the shoreline. So it's, it's shoreline, not necessarily underwater. And if it is tin, you will know when you run over it. Oh, I'm carrying too much. Okay, perfect. Let's go back to base then. And... Take the mushroom. Oh, you bring tidings! Uh, where are you? If you carry too much luggage, you will become encumbered, slowing you down and preventing you from regaining your stamina. Okay, good to know. This is a cool little area over here, too. I like this. Hi, guys. Um, is this where we were earlier? I think it is. There's some pretty big dudes over here, too. Big copper deposit. That could be handy. So that one's just like straight south of the base is where that big copper deposit is. As well as all of that stuff over there. I hope we lost them. Didn't. Excellent. Okay. Oh, this is where I was... This is what I was looking for earlier. Okay. Uh, apparently we gotta do this. Because... This stuff has a leash in this game that's attached to you. Oh crap, club died. Hi. Just gonna jump and stab you and stuff. All right, um. Get rid of you. Come on. Okay, we're just going to have to call this good, because I have run out of inventory space and then some. Oh boy, I have. Plus, we need to go repair this club. Jeez. This should be the other tin, or a uh, tin deposit, a uh, copper deposit. So that one is right here, and then the other one was like right there. They don't really show up anywhere, but that might be one of the buildings. Not sure. This is one of the few times with this game where I wish... There were a little higher fidelity. Otherwise, I generally don't mind. And I kind of like the, the lo-fi, low-res sort of thing it's going for. And as one of the few times, I would gladly take a little more detail. Give me a little more detail on the map and I'd be good. Just a touch more. Let's get back to base so we can see if we can do anything with this stuff. I suspect... We might not be able to do anything because we still need to go get the Sertling cores. Is that what it was, I think? Something like that. Are you still following? Because if you are, I mean, it's cool. It's free meat for me, basically. All right, here. Come on over here. Oh, now you're done? Okay, that's cool. I don't have anything to cook, just the one neck. Okay, that's cool. Alright, what can we do over here? Let's 
repair everything first. Okay, so we're good there. It looks like... We can't do any of those things. Stone Axe, we could re-upgrade that. We can't do any of that stuff either, because our thingy-majigger still is not level 4. So how do we get that up to level 4? Maybe we have to get those circling cores before we can get up to level 4. Uh, if nothing else, I know I need to make another storage chest. Can I put you over there? Okay. I want to just have to say that's fine, and then we'll drop off. Can I? There we go. Control click to transfer. Control click. Get it. A bunch of this other stuff I think we have elsewhere. It's just a matter of figuring out where. So I'm going to take care of that on my own. I don't have to torture you with me playing inventory management game. I guess we can put carrot seeds in there. I forgot. That's, that's one of the new things we got. And those guys go in there. I will figure out what to do with the rest of this stuff. You go check out patreon.com slash KIC gaming. When you are done with that, come back on the morrow as we continue playing more Valheim. Catch you that one, Dylan. Thanks for watching. See you later.